So today we went to the area of Palm Forest. This area is basically near about Tigra and there are quite a few good trails over here. The area itself is quite beautiful and has a few hills and a few valleys which are small and it has a sort of rock ravines uh, as I can think like ravines are usually sand but these ravines are basically cut by the rivers which form during the monsoon so they are quite deep and they are quite beautiful in their own way so while we were going there we had a few uh, off-road patches which we wanted to test which as you can see in the video that we are doing and there was this particular climb that I had seen earlier that goes by a temple which is located on a hill so I wanted to do that so before heading out actually to the palm forest we went to this particular climb and did that so this is the climb that is the temple that you can see the white color structure in the background this is Anuj with his gypsy going first up to the trail Did you go to eat? The trail itself was quite steep and it had quite a few rocks as you can see on the way. We didn't have to move uh, any rocks majorly, only a few small pieces. Most of them were in a position where we could get our cars through uh, it seemed difficult as a task at first but when we actually went to do it it seemed quite easy and it gave us a lot of confidence after that i came with my gurkha now the thing with gurkha is that the ground clearance is considerably less as compared to the gypsy so you have to choose your lines better but once you know how to choose those lines uh, the thing is not really that hard. So now you can see that temple again in the background. Uh, that temple is basically located on a cliff and it's a fortified sort of a temple. So the walls are quite tall and the temple is actually only a small part of that structure So once we reached the top of the plateau, we realized that there is not much to see over here. So there were two bikers, two cars and we looked around for a bit and we tried to find a trail from which we could descend that would be a different uh, way to get down from this place but as we couldn't find another way so we turned back and went down the same trail which was also a good experience at, as this was a good trail so as we started to go down Prakhar and Akshay who are the two bikers basically started off first and going down is pretty different from going up because while going up you have to use your power in a very different way and while coming down you basically have to control that power and keep it leashed in so that you go at a slow and controllable pace and this is what they are doing here Akshay had got a pair of new tires which were uh, as he says very good off-road tires from Pirelli so he was very happy with using those he got up very swiftly and also while coming down he had a good experience 
Prakar with his Meteor did quite well, taking it through places which actually required a higher ground clearance than what is available on his motorcycle, but he uh, did it with a lot of ease. So after having seen the temple, we decided to leave for visiting Palm Forest. The trail which leads down from the temple is quite steep, although it has been paved in recent days. Earlier it was not uh, smooth, it was very rocky as well, but now it is quite convenient to go up and down from. I'm
this area is basically what we call the palm forest we call this the palm forest because uh, there are thousands of palm trees in this area this is basically a valley situated between two uh, series of hills in the tigra area and i don't know for some reason uh, whether it is availability of water or maybe it was a historical plantation over here there are thousands of trees and the entire forest is just populated with all these palm trees which makes it very beautiful right now in this weather it's very hot and people have been burning as you can see the bushes under the trees are all brown that's because of fires and people have been burning these trees in very large numbers because of which they have depleted uh, but even though i think that in the coming monsoon they will rejuvenate and we will have this beautiful area uh, blooming again so when you go on this trail you will see that all the palm trees are basically on the left side of the trail and this is where the jungle is this is where the deeper part of the land is so i think this is where the water basically deposits and therefore due to the excess of moisture these uh, trees are able to thrive there is also a temple over here it's a hilltop temple if you stand on the trail from most of the points you can see that temple shining in white color and it's a good walk from the trail to the temple uh, unfortunately no cars or bikes can reach there because the area is very narrow and it's very thorny and bushy ek wahi hai ke modulaji wala modulaji falls ke chhedr mein hai lekin samne se banaye the na wo gaddha hai to wo samne ha yahan se aa jao for the last bit of the ride we went further towards tigra and we went in the area of modulaji falls and this is the area where the ravines are and we scouted some of these ravines uh, these are the areas which we have not seen we have seen we have driven through most of these uh, ravines or canals whatever you can call them and we have tried to make out ways through them but this this is a particular section we had not seen earlier so we are trying to assess how we can get the car down uh, to these as you can see this entire stretch is extremely beautiful and that ravine is actually only wide enough for a car so it seems like it has been made for off roading through these things but there are a few rocks uh, here and there and there are a few bushes here and there which create problems there are a few drops which are very steep which create problems but all of them get sorted somehow somewhere we find ways so we find entries we find exits into these places and it's a beautiful experience i think it is a feature which is very unique to this area and i don't see this anywhere else mostly in such a clean in such an untouched uh, way and the best part is that this is just 12 to 15 kilometers from the town